Hi Diamond friends, it's Diamonds for Linda. Thank you so much for stopping by my channel. Today I have a small shop haul, which has not been easy for me because I've been saving some of these packages for almost two weeks. I started purchasing at the beginning of the month because I wanted to do like a small shop haul. These are some of the stores that I've been wanting to buy from but haven't because I've been buying diamond paintings. So this month I pulled back on my diamond paintings so I could get some some um, support the small shops of diamond painting accessories. So I'm excited to dig in and I can't wait and I hope you are too. So thank you so much for joining me. Again, I really appreciate y'all stopping by. So I'm gonna go ahead and start with this one. This one is from DP with Sparklers. She was having a sale on um, a lot of her, her uh, like storage containers and things like that. And I really wanted one so I thought, well, now's a good time. She's having a sale and I will go ahead and snag one. So I put this one in my cart and then it disappeared. So I think someone else was probably shopping at the same time. I'm not exactly sure how the cart works, but it kind of like disappeared. Like it um, said it took it out of the cart because it's been purchased. But then I went back and tried it again. And so I don't know, maybe it was in someone's cart and they didn't go through with the purchase. So... I thought, so then I um, checked out really quick before it could get snagged again. At least that's what I think happened. So this one's packed really good. This is from DP with Sparklers from Tima. If you watch her, she's on, comes, she's on YouTube live every Friday, I think around nine or so. So I usually miss her, her lives because uh, my husband's home and we spend time together. So I... I usually watch her replays, which is a bummer because she does really nice giveaways. Okay, so let me just take this off. Make sure there's no invoice. So I don't, if you spend time on my channel, you know that I like the square containers. And so there was one with over a hundred. Um, oh, here's my packing slip so let me just take that out really quick isn't that pretty with the butterfly so here's her business card and she always sends a, a nice sticker isn't that pretty I love that sticker I use those and so this is the 108 containers in this one and I also ordered a little, I forgot to put, um, to add the magnet to this. So I'll just add my own. So here's the case. See, I'm going to go ahead and move that over. And let's see what the inside looks like. So it is these ones. I really love these. These are, I like using these ones. So this one has two layers, which is really nice. So it's 108. I was thinking I could either do one of my um, cross stitch conversions, kit it up in this one, or do the astronomer. I'm not sure. I gotta see how many colors the astronomer has. And I'm going to do the paint along with Mia. So we have that and then I had been really wanting one of those little turtle um, 3D printed cover minder. If you choose to put it in a cover minder, I forgot to add, um, put in the comment or like the, um, there's like a little section where you could say add the magnet, but I'll just add my own. The little turtle, isn't he so cute? So. I think the legs move, but I'm, this is the smaller one, so I don't want to force it, but isn't he so cute? So pretty. There were other sizes too, but I just wanted the smallest one. I think this might be small or medium. Let's see. It says medium, so this is the medium, so there's even a smaller one. So yeah, so I'm going to put a, a magnet right there, and then he'll be a cute little cover minder. So that's what I got from DP with Sparklers. 
Let's see, we'll put that off to the corner. Oh, I can't wait for the next ones. You guys, this has been so hard just letting all these pile up. So let me go ahead and get, I think it's called Pure Bliss Wax. Oh, that means I have one more item. Let me go get it. This one is not from a small shop haul, but it's, it kind of goes with the Pure Bliss Wax. I'll put that one there. So this one's from Corey. Um, she's a a diamond painter. She has a diamond painting YouTube channel, but I've been following her for a, a few years now. She has a coloring channel. She colors very beautifully. Um, it's called Colorfully Optimistic, and um, I have been watching. I started following her from there because I was doing coloring, and then she started diamond painting. So she. So now I follow her on her diamond painting channel. So if I remember, I will link both of her channels below. Um, yeah, she colors very nice. She's And she also water paints. So here's the box. Look at that presentation, that's so gorgeous. I love her tape right here. And it says, handle with care, I'm fragile. Thank you. And let me just make sure that my address, okay, it's not gonna show. So let me take this out. So let's see, it had this on top. It says, you're the best. If you can please leave a star review, a five star review on my Etsy, it helps my small business. And so here's her um, business. You can find her on, I think, Instagram and Etsy. As you see, it's very well packaged. So she sells putty, wax, wax melts, um, cover minders. She has some mugs, some stickers, and she does a monthly box, which I think I'm actually going to buy in December. So I've been wanting to get one of her monthly boxes, but just haven't because, um, you know, like I said, I was buying, it's either diamond paintings or accessories and things like that. So, so I think this goes here. I'm going to take all that off. Oops. So here, oh, it's a free gift. Peppermint swizzle stick. So this is one of her soy wax melts. Mmm. Let's see if I could open this. Mm, I can't. That's hard. Let me take it off. Okay, there we go. Let's see. Mmm, I can already smell it. Oh my goodness, it smells so good. So there's that. And then this was a combo. I know it's past like Halloween, but look how pretty, I love the bag. So there's this little cover minder. Here's, <clears throat> it's really windy outside. So I need to film this today because we're gonna, um, isn't that cute? It's a little candy corn. I wanted to film this in the living room so I could actually sit down and look at everything, but my kids are still here. So this is the wax. This is Golden Vanilla Diamond Daughter Sticky Wax. Mm, and that smells really good. I love her little tin that she has these in. So I needed to film this today because we're going to get the little guy. And um, tomorrow my husband's going to be off, so I usually don't film when he's here because, you know, I kind of get embarrassed. And then Thursday is is Thanksgiving and then Friday we're gonna leave to go pick up the little guy and then after that I don't know when I'm gonna film again. Oh excuse me. So here is some putty. I love how she packages everything. This is such a pretty color too this bag. I got candy corn, golden vanilla, and black cherry. Let's see. So this is candy corn. Mmm. Oh my goodness, it does smell like candy corn. I don't eat <clears throat> candy corns anymore. I used to love these when I was younger, so I was really looking forward to that. This is the golden vanilla putty. Mm, this one smells so good too. So here is what it looks like. like that. 
Mm, this just smells so good. I can't wait to try this. <clears throat> and black cherry. Let's see. Oh my goodness, that smells so good. <laughs> black cherry. And then I got this one. I think this is like um like a pad of wax that um I think she has leftovers or the smell wasn't just right or something like that if I'm remembering correctly. It's not there anymore because I think I think it's kind of um mm, smells good where the the scent was just not um perfect, I think. I think that's what this one is, if I'm, if I'm remembering correctly. And then look at this. This is for my wax melts. So let's take this off. Cute little scoop. Lavender chamomile. Soy wax melts. And I got this one because it was a little crumblies. And I wanted to try this. I've seen this before. I want to try some of her wax melts that have like four like allergies, but I didn't see that this time, so let's see, whoops. Mmm, that smells really good. So you have your little scoop. I love the box, the packaging too. You can probably put these in your compost pile when they're done. And there's a little scoop to that. And then this one is chai. Mm, I think you can already smell it. Let's just... I'm going to put the box over there. Oh my goodness, because I'm this is so low right here, every time I do um, unboxings, my nose starts getting runny. So here's how it looks. These are the crumbles. Mm, it smells good. I like that it's not overly strong. You know what else you could use these for? You'd probably plant something in there and then you know how you do the seedlings indoors and then you transfer it outdoors? And then you could probably just put this whole thing in the ground. I wonder that, well, there's a little bit of wax. Might work. Sorry about the crinkles. Oh, look how pretty that looks. There's some sparklies in there. Mm, that smells good. So, I got that. Where's the lid? And I couldn't find my wax melt. Uh oh, I don't think it's, oh yeah, it's gonna stay. So I ended up getting a wax melt too. So let's just go ahead and put that over there. this off. Let's see. The bottom says, thank you for supporting my small business. Okay, I forgot what I ordered from, from this. I knew I ordered these two though. Okay. So that was fun. Can't wait to try that. So since I got those and I couldn't find my my wax melts, what I did, I mean my wax um, warmer, I went on Amazon and I ordered me I ordered me this one. Look at this. It's a coffee mug. So I can't wait to use it. I'll just take it out really quick so we can take a peek at it. So here's the coffee mug lid. And I'll put a link below, but I think it's sold out right now. So you put this and then I'm also going to get um, something that you put in here so you could easily change out your waxes without having to clean this whole thing. So isn't that, I love this, life begins after coffee. I just thought it was so cute. So I got that, but I'll put this off to the side since it's not a small shop. <clears throat> Excuse me. Okay, so next let's go ahead and, so this one, 
is from Siobhan. She is so sweet. I was asking her about one of her cup reminders I got sold out. And then I felt bad because it took me forever to get back to her because I kept forgetting when I would go online because I don't do a whole lot through my phone. So I have I usually wait to do things when I get on my computer. And every time I kept getting on my computer, I forget to go check my Etsy messages. So, so thank you, Saban, for being so patient with me. I felt really bad because it was like 10 days later and she had already said, yeah, that she would save them or get some more for me. So she always puts some little candies in a cute little bag. And then here are some stickers. I love all the stickers. Oh, I like that one, this little gnome. And look at the Santa Claus. And here is, it says, thank you. Thank you, Linda. Happy holidays. And then this is her business card. And I will put all these links below. So, so this is the one that I was asking her about. I have had it in my card. I saved it too long. Somebody else purchased it. So I wanted to get this for me and a friend. So she said that she would get some more. Her cover minders are the best. I love her cover minders. So look at this. And she she uses the best magnets. So I think this comes down like that. Let's see. I'm getting stuck on the magnet right there. Okay, there it goes. Isn't that so pretty? I think there's supposed to be one more. I keep wanting to stick to the magnet. Okay, there you go. Look how pretty that is. Isn't that gorgeous? So I got two of these. I got one for me and one for my friend, except that the rain keeps wanting to stick to the magnet. <clears throat> and look at these magnets. She uses like the best magnets. I love the magnets she uses. And then I also got a Harry Potter. But look at this. She added a... She added a Christmas... I have some of her Christmas ones from last year. Look at that. Thanks. Thanks, Siobhan. That was so sweet of you. I love that. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna have to get one of those diamond paintings with the car, the trucks. Oh wait, I think I do have one actually. It's a Christmas one too. And then I wanted to get this one because I have a Harry, a Harry Potter diamond painting. So I thought that was a really cute one. So that's what I got from Saban. I love this. It's so funny though with the um, the ring that wants to stick to there. So check her out. She is so sweet. She works with you and she has uh, the best cover minders. So this one is from Diamond Pen Pal. And this says, thank you for supporting my small business. Love it, snap it and share it. I have been wanting to get a Diamonds Pen Pal pen for a long time. But, um, so I finally did. They have some new diamond painting pens that I want to get. They're really sparkly. But this is one that I have been wanting since last year. So I went ahead and got this one. So here is their beautiful business card. And there's the back. And they are on Etsy as well. And here's some cute little sticker with the yarn. Oh, look at Canvas Craft would love this one. And then you get some uh, single placer and a multi placer. And I believe you got to choose the multi placer. And look at this. How cute. My cover minder. Thank you. I'm going to use this when I get. I'm, there's, a, there's a diamond painting that I want to get of a dog. I think I actually have a, quite a few dog ones, though. But I want to get one of, that looks like my dog. And how cute. Look at that, a little miniature. That is so cute. I'm going to put that in my little miniature jar. And then there's a little tiny candy. Oh, I love that. I like the small candy because I don't really eat candy. So let's keep this cover minder out. It's really nice. Okay, now for the pen. Look at this. 
so this just reminds me of a candy cane or the North Pole or Santa. And it has this flat section right here, so it's not going to roll off your desk. But isn't that gorgeous? And I got the Chunky, because I think I'd do better with Chunky. So. And with the, um, where did I put the, the tips? I don't know how these ones will go in, but... If you do have a, a hard time, I know a lot of people use washi tape, but that just has never worked for me. Um, this one feels like it's gonna actually going to go in really nice. But I'm going to put a different tip in there. But what I do if, they're, if they don't is I'll put like those mini glue dots. I'll put two or three and then put it in, and then that works really well. The washi tape just doesn't work for me. I've tried so many times. I've tried so many other ways, but the glue dots seem to work really well. But isn't that gorgeous? I can't wait to get more from them. Okay, we're almost done. So this next one is called Bring the Happy Designs. It says Bring the Happy Designs right here. And let me make sure there's no invoice in here. Okay, well, I'll have to check. So here is the beautiful business card. This is on Etsy as well. It looks like it says bringthehappydesign.com. So these, oh, look at, there's a little bookmark in here. Wow, nice. How pretty is that? Look at that sparkle. And it says, thank you. And just make sure there's no paper. And so I guess, let me just make sure there's no invoice. I don't see one. So I got these, these are trays. Those trinket trays. Look how pretty. So this one, oh, it doesn't, I don't have an invoice, so I can't tell. It has these little feet down here, so it doesn't ruin any surfaces. Right here, it looks like it could have been um, um, filed down just a little bit, but that's under on the other side. So what I'm going to use this for is my diamond painting pens, and I love that it holds a whole diamond painting pen on there. And I can put my little cover minder, a little trash drill, or whatever. But I love, I just thought this was so pretty and sparkly. So there's that. And then here's another one. I just thought this was so gorgeous. And then the two, this one has the little feet on the bottom. Isn't that so pretty? Look at this. I just thought that was really pretty. And then you can put your diamond painting pens on there while you're, ooh, my no roll, while you're doing your diamond painting. Cause I usually have work with two pens, at least sometimes three, I know, really bad. So, and yeah, you could put all your other little things on here. So that is that. So pretty, those are really nice. I wasn't gonna get into all the trinket trays because I, um. I don't, I have other things that I use, but some of them are just so pretty. Okay, so let's put that back there. This came with that. And I love this one. This one's just so pretty. Look at all that sparkle. Okay, so this is the last of what I got. This is from Fairy Desk Clay. And it says, thank you for your order. Happy mail, handle with care, I'm fragile. And she actually has some really nice Christmas ones right now that I that came after I purchased this. So, so these are clay figures that you need to add. The, your you can make them into a cover minder. You could use them in your scrapbooks. You can um, um, put, make use them as a make them as a pin to wear or whatever you want to do. But I I put magnets on the back and then they become my cover minders. See if I get this open now. Looks like a little bit of tape on the other side. Let's see. I missed a whole section of tape. I thought I had got that before I started my video. I guess I didn't open this one at all. All the other ones I kind of slit the tape so that way you wouldn't have to wait. 
So I think her packaging is so pretty, like um, Corey's. Corey does a really great job with all her packaging. So let me just make sure that there is no um let's see 10% off our next order. I got my little packing slip here. And then so there's no fairy dust clay for updates. So there's I'll put the link below of to her um it's just fairydustclay.com, I believe. But I'll add that down below. Okay. I guess I should have zoomed you guys in all this time, huh? So right here it says, love it, brag about it. And she has a little freebie here or gift. Oh, here's her business card. Fairydustclay.com. So cute. And she include this little free gift. So cute, the little sleeping bunny. <laughs> That's cute. And then I love all the pink she has in here. And all these little hearts I save and I put them in a jar. So it says right here, thank you. Thank you for supporting this mama owned small business. packages everything really nice as you can see okay so here's one so they're flat on the back she also has some that are like standing which I would like to get one of those because you can still add a magnet to it so I just thought this one was so cute look at this cute little giraffe I get here or maybe it's a she because we're in flowers. Let's see. I think they have names. Um, I gotta take my glasses off to see. Oh, Cleo the spring giraffe. So this is Cleo the spring giraffe. And these ones are more fallish that I got because I wanted to, wanted them the last time, but I didn't get them all isn't she so cute look at her wearing her pumpkin look at her little bows and again they have names but cleo that's um this is just says Pum pumpkin girl halloween but isn't she so cute and again the backs are flat so you can put a magnet back there you could glue glue them on and look at this one so cute. I just thought this was so cute with the fall. Oh, this one actually has the hat. Is, um... Oh, how cute. The hat is actually material. How cute is that? So I'll just put a magnet right here. Here with her little teddy bear. And then this one was so cute. I just, once when I saw this in her feed, oh no, we got a little piece that came off. Let's see, where did he go? I'll have to find out. Maybe he went down here. I'll look, I'll look on her website and then glue that back on. Isn't that cute? So maybe he was holding the gingerbread. Maybe it was right here. But I'll look on her website. And again, you just put the magnet in the back. So I'm gonna put this one back in the bag so I don't lose the little piece that I gotta glue back on as I um, drop it. Okay, that's going back in the bag. So we don't wanna lose that. And let's see, look at this one. This is like watermelon. Oops, better move that out of the way. So this one is Watermelon Girl. How cute is that? Look at her little bow. So cute. And again, the flat back. And the last one is this cute little unicorn with um, the candy corn. So now you all know that I love candy corn, but I just don't eat it anymore. 
and there's a flat back. So you can put your magnet. Mm, so cute. And I think that was my last one. So that is what I got. So let's put all these away because I'm going to save those. They're so pretty. They're like heart shapes. That's so funny with the hat. I didn't realize it was really material. So cute. Don't want to take that one out. I guess we could take the little watermelon girl out. Oh, my stomach growled. I love it. So that is my small shop haul. I got some cover minders by Saban. I got a pen pal pen. I love that it's like candy cane. I got some Bliss Studio, no, Pure Bliss Wax. Can't wait to use that. Got some trays, some trinket trays, little clay figures, and another cover minder that I'm going to make into a cover minder. I guess I got a lot of cover minders in this one. And I'm looking forward to getting up in this beautiful case. It's so pretty. The handle pops up a little bit. I think it comes out. So that is what I got. Oh yeah. And then you can't forget my, my coffee cup. I just love this. It's going to be fun to use, but I still want to get those inserts. That way I'm not having to clean all the wax out of here. So I need to order those so I can start using my wax melts. So thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Hope you enjoyed my little small shop haul and I will see you in my next video. And if, oh, if you're here to the end, maybe we could do like a little, I don't know if there's a unicorn emoji. We could do one of these. There's a watermelon or a pumpkin. So again, I appreciate you staying to the end. And um, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. I'd really appreciate it. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.